So the Rabbi Avram continues, He called, Everything that comes to a person from a Navi. In other words, the third Madrega was the entire idea that Neviim and, and people who experience Ruch HaKodesh, people who experience that level of Ashgach HaPratis are obligated with a higher level of Betochen. Says the Rabbi Avram, the same would apply if a Novi comes to one of us and tells us something. In that case, we also have to have that level of Betochen for on what the Novi has told us. Other Rabbi says, the other Rabbi says in the midbar we clearly saw that the Charoin Af Rahman Islam that came with Israel was because they didn't believe what the Novi said, even though they knew he was a Novi. They were asking questions beyond that point. Rabbi says, he says the Pasuk tells us not to do that again. In other words, once a Novi, once we know someone is a Novi, once a, a Novi tells us in a Vua and is Amsud of Osoi, we're mechuyiv to believe him on this third level of Betochim, Mamash, a level of Yedir. L'chein alecha ladas, ki chayovim onu klal shermat ter. So says now the Rabbi Avram, a person has to know that any shermat ter mitzvah is mechuyiv to have Betochim HaKadosh Baruch Hu as in the first two Madregas, which means the first one to have Betochim in all aspects of his life and rely on HaKadosh Baruch Hu for them. And the second level of Betochim, not to just think I still have a fear of maybe my various are going to stand in the way or things like that, but other Rabbi employ the Rishon and bikush and tfila and 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 strengthen one's betachin through that. And however, hamaylan shlishes the third level it, it does not become an obligation for a person as long as long as we don't have a clear message ashgach protest that shows us that we are now on a level that we are obligated to have the third level of betachin. We're not there yet. Or if a Novi comes to tell us something. He says, the end of the Pasuk says, He says, Baruch of course, is the Tzura Elamim, and therefore, even when a person relies on something within there, that is still the Bayre Elamim, Therefore, says Rabbi Avram, once a person has a clarity in this topic, it's obvious that a person should never rely on anything or anyone but HaKadosh Baruch Hu himself. As the Pasuk says, Don't rely on people who promise things. Don't rely on people who have no ability to actually give you anything. It's only to rely on HaKadosh Baruch Hu himself. Have a wonderful day.